My personal experience was as a family physician in rural Manitoba in 1993. And I was in my office and on one particular day, a young man came into my office with his wife. He was in his mid forties. And um, it was the first time I'd seen him, seen him in my practice. And he sat down in front of me, looked very uncomfortable. And, um, and said to me that he couldn't live life like this anymore. He was living in, in severe, severe pain because he had metastatic colon cancer. And I, I, I vividly remember feeling extremely uncomfortable with the situation. And looking back, my discomfort was because I'd never received any education in the area. And I asked him what he was on for pain, and he said he was on morphine and he was on very small doses. But I knew no better, so I said to him, I'm sorry, I can't increase your morphine because you'll become addicted. And I remember him looking at me, getting up, and he began to cry, and he said to me, I hope one day, as physicians, you can better look after us, and he walked out of the office. You know, often when they hear the word palliative, they think this is the end. We're in the last few days or weeks of our lives, and it's, and it's very frightening. And I think one of the most important messages we have to try to convey to the public is that palliative care is not just about dying. It's not just about the last few days or weeks of life. Palliative care is about improving the quality of life for anyone who has an advancing, progressive illness. But it can be many, many months and sometimes even years before the death. Palliative care is about celebrating life. Palliative care is about improving life. Death represents a failure for health professionals. And therefore, if, because it's a failure, we walk away from it. I think the other challenge is that we're never trained, we're never educated on how to engage someone who's dying or their family. And so because of that, if you're not sure how to do something, if you're not comfortable doing something, you don't do it, you walk away from it. The important thing is to view palliative care as an integral part of the healthcare system. Palliative care is not just this small specialization that's set aside. And when a patient is now dying, they get moved to a hospice or to a palliative care unit. Palliative care is an approach that's integral within the healthcare system. And so if all of us are practicing the good principles of palliative care, it becomes integrated.